today on this 2010 Ford van. We're going to take a look at the best hitch options available. All right, these are the three hitches we have here. First one on top, we have our Ultra Frame from Draw Type, part number 41945. Now this is a class five hitch. Next one up is our Kurt, part number 14055. This one is a class four hitch. And down here we have another one from Draw Type, part number 75703. And this one will be a class three hitch. Let's go ahead and take a look at the Ultra Frame from Draw Type. You notice the receiver assembly here, created from a cast component. This allows it to be a lot stronger and more suitable for everyday use and light industrial applications. Now a Kurt and a Draw Type are going to have the same conventional construction as you've seen all the time on a regular hitch. It's with a steel square tube on both of them. They're also all going to be two inch receivers. All right, let's go ahead and cover the weight capacities of our hitch. First off, I'll start off our heaviest one right here, the Draw Type Ultra Frame which is rated for 10,000 pounds of pull weight and 1,500 pounds of tongue weight, which is the weight that pushes down on the hitch. Next up is our Kurt. By itself, it's gonna have a 1,000 pound tongue weight capacity and a 10,000 pound pulling capacity. We go down to our drawer tight here in the 75 series, 600 pounds of tongue weight and a 6,000 pounds pull weight. Now all our capacities do change when you add a weight distribution assembly to that. For instance, on our ultra frame hitch, our pull weight goes up to 12,000 pounds but you notice that the tongue weight actually goes down to 1,200 pounds. On our Kurt, our pull weight goes up to 12,000 pounds, and our tongue weight goes up to 1,200 pounds. In our draw tight here at the bottom, this will go up to 1,000 pounds of tongue weight and 10,000 pounds of pulling weight. Let's go ahead and take a look at the safety chain loops. If we look on our ultra frame here, this is part of a cast construction right here, and this will uh, accommodate a very large variety of safety hooks. Now, draw tight here carries the same theme with the wide holes on here, but does have a little bit less uh, heavy duty construction to it. And going back to our current hitch here, you'll notice it has a regular standard opening for your safety hooks. Installation wise, these two, the Ultra Frame from Draw Tight and our Kurt here, they both install the same and actually use the same bolt holes and no drilling required on these two. Now, our Draw Tight hitch on the bottom here does have a variety of holes on it, but there are a few years out there that does require drilling. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at our draw tights. They do have one additional feature on them. They both have the additional hole right here. This is designed for use with our J-pin stabilization pin. This is great for accessories that do not have their own anti-rattle devices. Comparing that to our Kurt hitch here, it doesn't have an additional hole. wasn't designed for that application. However, so if you want anti-rattle devices, you have to use the one that come with your accessories. Okay, now we'll go ahead and cover our construction of the hitches. The draw tight is designed to be heavy duty, so it's going to have a really massive square tube right here. And also has a nice engineered bend in it to help match up to the vehicle. If we look at our Kurt here, it's got the traditional square tubing that goes out to the frame rails. However, it has an angle built into it going out to the arm so it doesn't have a curve like this one does. Okay, now our 75 series hitch also carries the same angle as our Kurt hitch does to match up to the vehicle. There's all these angles and curves built into the hitches help accommodate the spare tire. Now our 75 series draw tight here also has a round tube construction. So you're looking for a light duty application and you like the looks of this one, this may be the one for you. Let's go ahead and recap a few things. For weight capacity, our draw tight ultra frame is gonna be at the top of our list. In this case, our clearance is gonna be the best on our hitch here from Kurt. This hitch actually rises about one inch higher than compared to our two draw tight hitches. All right, for general overall towing purposes, probably your best bet is gonna be either the Kurt or a draw tight. You just have to determine how much weight capacity you need for your trailer. And for basic recreational purposes, such as very light trailers or accessories like a cargo carrier or a bicycle rack, the 75 series from draw tight will work great in that application. All right, and now I'll finish it for the best options that are available for our Ford van. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.